In today's video, I'll be taking this illustration I did of a bumblebee, and I'll be scanning that into Procreate, and I'll be enhancing that there, and I will take you along for that. Hi everyone, this is John Small. I'm an artist and an illustrator, and today I'm going to be taking you into Procreate from an illustration that I created. And often in Procreate, you can start an illustration directly in the program, or you can take one of your own drawings that you've scanned and you can place it in. You can even take a photo of your drawing, your hand drawing, uh, your painting, um, a sketch that you've done, bring that into Procreate, and you can enhance the work that you've done digitally. So you're still capturing uh, what you intended to on paper and or canvas and you're taking that and you're putting it into a digital uh, realm which is a little bit easier to work with. If you're not familiar with Procreate it's an application that's downloaded onto the iPad or an iPhone and you can create digital art. One of the great things about that is you can take the iPad or the iPhone anywhere. You can go to a coffee shop, you can go out in nature, you can be anywhere in your house in a room and you can sketch, you can paint, illustrate, draw. Uh, it's a really versatile program and uh, it's a high quality uh, illustrator's tool. A lot of people are more comfortable working with paper, at least initially. Uh, they might like the feel of the pencil on the paper. A lot of the work that I do is on paper, as you can see behind me and next to me and this piece I'm holding here with the bumblebee. But if you need it for a digital purpose, you can take that work, you can take a photograph of it with an iPad, for example, and then in a program like Procreate, which I'll be using today, you can digitally enhance that piece. So you can add a different background, um, you can add more elements to it without changing your original, your original work of art. This bumblebee drawing was just one element in a composition, so I will be showing you just a little bit how I enhanced this piece today. This is the final piece there, and right now it's just transitioning to the beginning, and I'm creating the splash of water that I'm going to have the bumblebee diving into. There's the scanned image of the bumblebee, and I'm just cleaning up that paper around. Again, I just took a scanned image of the drawing I did, the illustration, brought that into Procreate, and I'm just cleaning up that paper around the bumblebee now. And what I was working on was the splash effect, having the bumblebee jump into water um, as it's flying downward, hitting a puddle, and then jumping up, and just having a fun time. This is just one element. There were other characters in the final composition for the children's CD that I illustrated, and I'm just adding a little bit of touch up there now. And that was the completion of that section. If you enjoyed this video, please give a thumbs up and leave a comment and let me know what you'd like to see going forward. I have a lot more videos on Procreate. I have a lot of hand-drawn, uh, mostly in colored pencil and pastel pencil, as well as charcoal. And let me know if you'd like to see that process. Click that red subscription button below and there's also a little circle that will show up right around here. And if you can click that and you'll subscribe to my channel, that would be fantastic. When you subscribe, if you click that little notification bell, it will alert you when I have a new video uploaded. Every Friday I'm posting art-related videos, so I hope you stick around and tune into those. Thanks again for watching.